Hey, Kenneth here, and today I'm going to show you guys how to drive a Numatron tube. So I just got a shipment of six of these from Russia. And what these are, are these are IV-9 style Numatron tubes. So what is a Numatron tube? A Numatron tube is, you won't be able to see it, but it's eight very small incandescent filaments. So it's like a light bulb, but very specially shaped so that you can display numbers on it. So on this breadboard, what we have is we have a at tiny 2313 microcontroller and then a Allegro LED constant current driver. And then I have, I have the constant current driver set for 20 milliamps in each segment. And then I just have a little sketch going where I have it just cycling between numbers. And so what it does is it passes current along each segment and that makes it light up just like a light bulb. And then you just selectively select the segments to light up that you want lit up. All right. Now, you can get these for about $3 each on eBay. My seller was even kind enough to send me a data sheet for it in Russian. So, find one of your Russian friends and have them translate it. And the main thing you're looking for is this, this number right here, where it says uh, something, something, something milliamps. 17.0 to 22.0. So that means that we want about 20 milliamps of current on each filament. The pinout diagram is fairly self-explanatory, um, but these are real easy to drive because it's just just some current. All right. So, taking looking at the LED constant current driver, these are real easy. You can just use resistors if you wanted and transistors, um, but for multiplexing displays with several tubes, I'm actually using the LED drivers, which are really easy because you can say, I want 20 milliamps current on this table, which is in the data sheet. And you go and you just follow the line out. And on the data sheet, it says you then want a 900 ohm resistor. Um, and then every single one of the eight output pins on the driver will put out 20 milliamps. Of course, there are no 900 ohm resistors, but taking a 1k ohm resistor and a 10k ohm resistor, we can make something that's, you know, pretty close, like 909. Uh, this also lets it, makes it real easy for you to change the drive current. So it's like, well, that's a little too bright for me. Lower the resistance a little bit, and it, uh, and it gets a little bit dimmer. Or I guess raise the resistance, and it gets dimmer. Lower the resistance. The main thing is, the current out of one pin drives the current out of the other other eight. So I thought that'd be pretty neat. Uh, so this is, uh, I, uh, Numatron tubes are a real easy beginning uh, classic display. They're much easier to drive than vacuum fluorescents or Nixie tubes, uh, which they're often confused with, but they are not the same thing. So I encourage you get on eBay, buy up a few of them, and then have fun.